So this is how to affect the G. You just no, go here. No, no, oh, ah, uh ah, -huh, ah, uh -huh. no, turn it, ah, 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 This is like a hand. If you ever come to the first cafe, take a photo with the stage mirror because then you get this in the background and it's just the best place. Like, this is where I always take all my photos when I come to the first cafe. So make sure you do it. Hello, it's Wednesday afternoon. I think it's all past the afternoon, near evening. I really did nothing today. I woke up at like midday, the same as yesterday, because I always stay up really late now. I decided last minute to book to see the showstoppers today. It's about 1,000 performance at the other palace, and I've seen them like four or five times. They really helped me through last year watching them. Kind of gave me that nice bit of energy. Um, and Donna's going to be there, so I kind of gave him partly just to see Donna, and because I haven't really seen a show since coming back to London, so I thought this was quite. Well, I haven't seen like a proper like stage show. I've seen a couple of concerts, but that's all. So, yeah. Um, on Monday, I went to see guys sing dolls. That's what you would have seen. Um, it was really good. I'm like a major fan of gender reversed musical theatre songs, so loved it. Um, I mean, yesterday I went to the theatre cafe in the afternoon. Oh no, I went to see Georgia. You saw G before then. Um, and then I went to the theatre cafe yesterday. And actually got quite a lot of Western Pitney posts. So make sure you follow them on Instagram and Twitter. So I'm doing all like news, anything like that on there. So they're quite cool the posts, mainly on Instagram at the minute. So I'm trying to build it. And then I introduced Libby to the pub, Waxy O'Connor's, and she loved it. So I was like, yay! And I was going to film in there, but then we got too deep in conversation. So I forgot to play out. But yeah. And I know I mentioned before about like healthy eating, healthy stuff. Which yeah, it's really important to me. Well. Um, I feel a lot better, and my sleep's a lot better, and stuff like that. So I thought I'd lost a lot of weight, went on scales today. I was supposed to get my heaviest, which I don't feel like I am. I don't think anybody else has had that feeling before. So I decided to walk all the way to Victoria, because I've got time, and got a two litre bottle of water. I started to mean to go on. So I totally went to Harrods to find the toilets. So I delayed my walk a bit, but um, I got trapped in Kensington Gardens. <laughs> I found like a weird barrier exit. I'm just walking up to the other palace. Olivia's already here and Donna should be here in the next 10 minutes. Reunion. And I managed to finish that two litres of water. Yes. <laughs> I just managed to see Jordan, Amy and Olivia in the first cafe. I managed to get some work done, but now I'm off to find the Soho Hotel. So I'm off to a special screening of Green Book. This is the first time I've ever been to like a special screening of a film. So I'm like hella excited. I don't know much about the film. I've also never been to this hotel before. So I'm hoping I find it. And I'm hoping I enjoy it. Good morning, it's Friday. Hello. I've got to get ready in a sec. I've got a few hours until my train, but I went ahead off early because I always end up pushing the time too late and stressing. I'm trading back home to the Midlands till Sunday. See the family because I won't see them until mid Feb after this weekend. So it's kind of nice. It's only been like a week, two weeks since I last was with them. Then I'll see them like in a couple of weeks after that when my parents go down to see Hamilton and Six and Waitress. But um, yeah, so I'm gonna go home for a couple of days, which would be nice, have a little weekend with them. Green Book last night was amazing. It was so cool. 
It really felt, felt much better because I didn't know. It was a, like a new environment with loads of different people in there. It was cool to be in a different environment because I'm not used to like the type of people that are invited to those things. But meet new people. <laughs> there were people that I knew as well, so it was cool. Um, but the film was amazing. Like, it was just such a good film. So, if you didn't know, Green Book is based off a real story. It's all about the like unlikely friendship between two people who are so different in like many ways in a time period where you wouldn't think would you would think would work against them becoming friends and it ended up being like the best partnership. I don't want to give too much away, but it's just so good. Watch it. Watch it. <laughs> Uh-huh. Oh yeah, so <laughs> me and the family went out for the day. Nothing really happened yesterday other than coming back to London. <laughs> to the Midlands. <laughs> um, we had Chinese last night. Yeah. But, um, I'm haggish today because we are celebrating Burns Night a day late. <laughs> today the Jamie cast left. Well, a lot of them did. So that means on Monday the new cast start, which I'm really excited for. I kind of get it over somehow. I didn't get down to it on the last week of the original cast. Puff, puff, puff. I'm really excited to go and see the new cast, so I need to find when I'm going to see them. And what else do I need to tell you? Hades Town closed today too. Good, I didn't go back. But I'm so glad that I got to see it while it was here. Oh, tomorrow I head back down to London and I'm going to see Ryan's, um, Ryan Carter's Refresh concert. I've seen it once before, it, but never like to this scale and I'm so excited to like rep it and like I know it's going to be amazing already because from what I saw from the time I saw it at the hospital club, I just know it's going to be incredible. So I'm so excited. So that's the plan for tomorrow. And I just bought Canva Professional. Well, my monthly payments, but yeah. Because um, I use Canva for everything, like editing, but I really am dedicated to everything. So it was kind of my dedication and my this dedicated and then I pressed it. So now I'm official to create and stuff for Western Picnic and for my stuff. So... Make sure you're following West End Picnic on Instagram and Twitter. And Theatre Walls and me, Erin Dreams UK. Because I need all the love while I'm working and trying to create all this stuff because I'm scary if I don't have the people with me. <laughs> right, I better take this up to bed and try and get some more stuff done before I go to sleep. So, this is how different my room looks now. Back home. Look at all this space. And my Mickey memories and stuff have come here and all my pop. I think we're all going to stay here for a bit. Because I look nicer and I don't really need them with me, my Mickey 90 of pops. But yeah, so at the minute they're all here until I move into a bigger place or I decide I want some of them back in London. Wave Nan. Oh God. Wave Nan. Hello, it's Monday. Um, you would have seen on Sunday that I went to see Riker Creative's Refresh concert at the Shaw Theatre. It was their London debut of the full scale show. They've done like smaller cabaret shows in London before because I've been to one. I, I don't know if I vlogged it and put it up, I can't remember. Um, but yeah, and it was amazing. I really enjoyed it. Um, it's crazy to see how much it's grown since the last time I saw it, um, which I really enjoyed it then, but it's so cool to see like in such a small amount of time how much Ryan. Um, Ryan Carter, who's currently in Motown, is the, the producer, the guy who put it all together. Um, he's a great guy, he's a lovely friend. But um, yeah, um, it's amazing what he's been able to do in such, such a short span, really, in like a year to change it from a small cabaret intimate event to a full scale big show. And I'm really excited to see what happens. Some of the songs are like the arrangements are insane. And their version of My Favourite Thing this is so different from the original and so interesting. Oh, there's just some great numbers. Um, they did Seasons of Love at the end, um, their version of it, and it was really nice because of, of course it was a day of Rent Live. I stayed up until 4am watching Rent Live. I have mixed views. I'm going to film a reaction video or a review video because I have a lot of thoughts. But um, yeah, it was good. And I didn't vlog as much as I wanted to, but you know, happens. Um, the Jamie cast changed on Saturday, so I was a bit like, and I nearly went today because today's Monday. Nearly did, but it sold out. So I'm gonna try and get to see the new cast at some point, either this week or next. But yeah, fun.
too. So um, if you haven't already, subscribe down below. Let me know what type of videos you want. Because I'm going to be trying to do videos a lot more often. So it'd be great to find out what you want. And who you want to see. Because I want to do some collabs and stuff too. So yeah, subscribe. And I shall see you the next time. Oh, that's somebody else's thing. Oh yeah. <laughs> I love you or not. Bye. Bye, 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 bye.